Cycling indoors, you're pedaling towards fitness, but are you also steering clear of injuries? Let's dive into the common indoor cycling injuries and the expert tips to avoid them. First up, the dreaded cyclist's knee. Tanya Weeks, a professional trainer, warns of the strain indoor cycling can put on your knees. The solution? Kelly Chase, a certified health coach, advises, rider needs to have a 30 degree bend in their knee on the downstroke. Ensure your seat is hip level and your knee aligns with the pedal's center. Next, we tackle back and shoulder pain, often stemming from poor posture. The fix is straightforward. Engage your core, keep your back straight, and avoid excessive swaying. Remember, a strong core is your back's best friend. Wrist strain can sneak up if you're not careful. Chase emphasizes the importance of proper form. There should only be a slight bend in the elbows. Keep those wrists straight and let your lower body do the heavy lifting. Don't forget your feet. Tight pedal straps or small shoes can lead to metatarsalgia, causing numbness or tingling. Check your shoe size and strap tension to keep your toes happy. Saddle sores are a real pain in the, well, you know. To combat this, adjust your seat height, invest in padded cycling shorts, and consider a gel seat cover for extra comfort. Lastly, uncontrolled movements, especially in rhythm-based classes, can lead to injury. Weeks advises, start slowly. Master the beat with your feet before adding arm moves and combinations. Remember, proper bike setup and technique are key to strengthening your body without wearing it out. If in doubt, seek guidance from your instructor or the Aptive app trainers. Keep pedaling, but most importantly, Keep it safe.